Cardiac asthma, causes, signs, and symptoms, diagnosis, and treatment. Although the name might suggest otherwise, cardiac asthma is not a type of asthma. It refers to complications that result from cardiac failure. Cardiac asthma is a very dangerous condition. It can often be misdiagnosed as asthma because of similar symptoms, which can potentially be life-threatening. Let's take a deeper look at cardiac asthma. Causes Cardiac asthma is caused by a fluid buildup in the lungs as a result of cardiac failure. Congestive heart failure can create complications in the left ventricle of the heart. The left ventricle is the heart's chamber that is responsible for sending blood throughout the body. The heart is not able to pump blood out of the left ventricle and might have extensive pressure on it as well. Because of that, blood accumulates in the heart and leaks out, which can lead to fluid buildup. In such cases, cardiac asthma is an indication of congestive heart failure, but is still often not treated that way because of the symptoms a patient shows. Other health problems such as an abnormal heart rhythm, hypertension, diabetes, and hypothyroidism can also cause cardiac asthma. Signs and Symptoms The common signs of cardiac asthma include 1. Trouble breathing 2. Wheezing 3. Rapid breathing 4. Coughing 5. Bloody or frothy sputum 6. Grunting 7. Orthopnea, which is a shortness of breath felt when laying down 8. Paroxysmal nocturnal or waking up at night gasping for air 9. Abnormal sounds coming from the chest known as rails. These symptoms are the same as the ones found in asthma. A lot of times there is no sign that helps differentiate between the two. Cardiac asthma is often the very first sign of congestive heart failure. However, it can also show up with symptoms of heart failure, such as 1. Fainting 2. Chest pain 3. Fatigue 4. Skin with bluish hue 5. Irregular heart rate 6. Swelling in feet, legs, or ankles 7. Increased urination during the nighttime 8. Increased fluid retention which causes weight gain Diagnosis Diagnosing cardiac asthma is crucial as it signals congestive heart disease and it is quite difficult to diagnose because of the signs matching those of asthma. Because of this, cardiac asthma is often misdiagnosed which can prove to be fatal. The diagnosis starts from the medical history. If there is no history of asthma, doctors might suspect cardiac asthma and run procedures such as a physical exam followed by blood tests and tests such as an electrocardiogram and an echocardiogram. Furthermore, a chest x-ray may be taken to look for any enlargement in the heart. CT scans or MRIs may follow to develop a clearer idea of the problem. Treatment. Proper treatment with cardiac asthma involves finding the problem causing it and treating that. However, some medications such as morphine, nitroglycerin, or diuretics may also be administered to relieve the asthmatic symptoms. Further treatment can include aiding breathing with some non-invasive ventilator. A breathing tube may be used in serious cases. Lastly, Surgeries such as an angioplasty or coronary bypass may be performed in case a heart attack is apparent. Thank you for watching our video. Please do not forget to like and share the video. Also, please subscribe to the channel to stay updated on our latest videos.